Okay, so this is the original infographic, and this is the one that has been recreated using Gemini Non Banana Pro. So basically, it is following the same design as the one that I have on this original content. So in this video, I'm going to show you how you can create a consistent branded infographics using Gemini Non Banana Pro, and it is actually a lot simpler and easier than I thought. So let me show you how you can do it. Let's open Gemini. And here we actually want to utilize a feature in Gemini that I think not many people are using and it is called gems. So open the side menu and then click explore gems. And right here, basically we want to create a sort of folder that contains an instruction about what AI need to do when user is asking AI to generate an infographic. So click new gem. And after that, let's call this one my, let's say company infographic there you go description is optional but instruction here is basically mandatory so this is the technique that i used to create this picture that is basically able to copy the style of the previous infographic essentially this is the problem you can find this problem in the description down below just copy it and you can actually make some modifications for example you can specify perhaps the aspect ratio of the infographic you can also include some extra instructions or information but this is the very basic the bare minimum that you can use to create a somewhat consistent infographic and after that we want to utilize the knowledge base in the gems so basically you have to upload the picture or some pictures that contain some visual information about the infographic so let me just use this uh, this is what the original infographic look like it's actually look awesome and i want to copy this design on my future infographics now let me just go back to gems and you can upload other documents you can upload other pictures it's up to you but i'll just use one example now when you're done you can click save and by the way, you can also uh, double check it. You can try to create a picture right here on this uh, testing window. Now I'm going to close this and to access the infographic, oh, sorry, to access the gems that contains the infographic information, you can click this or you can click export gems and then you can select the infographic that you want to have a chat with. So let me just open it. And here, let's say I want to know how to be good at, let's say, playing guitar and click tools click create images make sure that you're using the thinking model which is gemini nano banana pro send a message and just wait so this process is actually a lot less complicated than having to manually describe the brand color the secondary color the layout etc you can still do that by the way you can still modify the prompt that i provided earlier and you can add some extra information that could be relevant for your organization or businesses but uh, this is the basic that you can try and on my testing it seems to be quite consistent at copying the style of the existing infographics or visual content or documents that you just provided now i'm still waiting for it to generate picture there you go so i got this picture and as you can see it is able to modify the content uh, if you look closely the text is different there are some similarities like the colors the structure but the content and also the text are definitely very different and now it is talking about how to uh, be good at playing the instrument so it was again coming from this original design and i think this is actually a really unique and really cool capability of gemini nano banana pro so yeah that's basically how you can generate a branded infographic quite consistently using the gems the gems feature in gemini ai thanks so much for watching and i'll see you on my next video i wish you a great day ahead